bright duty every student matters how would you rewrite euclid's fifth postulate so that it would be easier to understand so it is left to you to write this because everybody can write it differently so you just need to say that these two are co-interior angles and where the sum of co-interior angles is lesser than 180 the lines will meet on that side okay or you can start with the definition of parallel lines that sum of co-interior angles is equal to 180 for the lines to be parallel if it is lesser than 180 the lines will meet on that side right so you can rewrite euclid's fifth postulate in many ways out of which you can choose any one okay does euclid's fifth postulate imply the existence of parallel lines explain so yes we have discussed it earlier also that euclid's fifth postulate implies existence of existence of parallel lines because euclid's fifth postulate suggests us that when the sum of these co-interior angles or when the sum of these angles is lesser than 180 they will meet on that side right in case their sum is 180 they will never meet right so it is a direct implication of euclid's fifth postulate so yes this part we have already covered in our discussion okay i hope after this exercise we are we have a clear idea about euclid's axioms and postulates and how to attempt these questions using that knowledge of axioms and postulates you should always keep that those definitions axioms and postulates in your mind before attempting the questions in this chapter from the examination point of view you might have one or two marker from this this chapter but those marks are easy to grab so you should not lose those marks and study this chapter carefully thank you